Hello everybody and welcome back uh, to the Lambert's Company. Ba -na -na -ba -na -na -ba -ba. <clears throat> okay, so I already collected it. Um, I probably shouldn't have, because <laughs> uh, I know you guys like to see me collect stuff. But uh, we got another free 10 summon, I believe. I already forget, I collected it like an hour ago. But um, it's another free 10 summon majiggy so we are going to go ahead and extract also um i know i mentioned it i uh, oh geez i believe two episodes ago i did figure out what the paid extract for is it's um it's actual currency that you you know buy so that's what that is so we're gonna go for the standard extraction I would go for the targeted extraction, but I want a chance for everybody, not just Gregor. So that's why I keep uh, coming here. So let's use, <laughs> it, it, you know, I'm like, all right, we've used all our cards. It'll be totally fine. And then we get another card, <laughs> which is fine. You can't go wrong with 10 free summons. Uh, I'm just not using them. They're basically just for vanity for me. So let us see what monstrosities we'll get this time. Okay, no three star, but that's okay. Very cool. All right, starting to get some bits for her. All right, Liu. Dude, I'm so bad with names, I'm so sorry. All right, two and two. Two and three. All right. Uh, which one are we feeling good about? This one. Ah, G Corp skin. Works for me. Uh, let's see what we got here. Oh, actually. <laughs> Can we get W Corp for, uh, for Fast? W Corp Fast? Here we go. Be no whammies? It was fast, but <laughs> not the one I was looking for. Alright, that's fine. Um, okay. All in all, that was uh, pretty good. So, let me see. By the way, this is still the skin I want. More than anything else in the game. This is the one that if I'm going to use any of these, it's going to be this one. Honestly, it's probably going to be the full W Corp uh, skin line. But we're not even close to this one. Um, but man, oh man, that would just be mwah. Can't go wrong with a bunch of this. Holy, what, dude, how many? Okay, hang on. So if you've got eight charge, you hit them with four defense downs. Dude, they're basically dead the next turn. What? <laughs> Okay, now where is W... Ah, here it is. So, W Corp Fast is another skin I... I, uh, I basically just want the full W Corp skin line. It's just so good looking. Like, I don't know. But maybe it's not very good. But it certainly looks awesome. Also, apparently level 30 is a max. Uh, we'll have to keep that in mind. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> dreaming of what could be... But, uh, obviously, probably won't be. Let's look at passives. Uh, self-charge, gain plus one charge count after an attack. One ally with the lowest max HP gains plus one charge. Whoa, it has synergy with itself. Oh, literally W Corp synergy. Also, I'm sorry. I just, I want to, <laughs> I want to look at these because who knows? Maybe after everything's said and done, I'll play through with just W Corp. I don't know. Uh, when attacked, gain plus one charge count. Envy resistance. Oh. So this works... Okay, so this this is for passive stuff. Okay. Alright, you know what? That makes a lot of sense. Uh, two times per turn. One ally with the lowest speed inflicts plus one rupture. Whoa. And then, of course, best girl... At the start of the combat phase, gain charge count by Gloom Resistance by 3. One ally with the highest speed 
gains plus one final power to their first skill. Ugh. So a lot of teamwork synergy in these. Now that being said, our actual sinners did level up. Here, I'm gonna go to team two. These are all super nice. Um, but let's see. So apparently we have some actual passives now. I wanna look at those. I don't know how though. Um, I guess we just don't, because I know we have passives and stuff. I'm just not entirely sure how to look at them. Yeah, you know what? We'll figure it out later. Uh, for the moment, oh, I believe it's time to start the unloving. Also, yes, I did stock up on a bunch of these and I'm full energy without using any boxes. It's called value. You might notice my energy's a little different. Uh, I was warned this chapter is exceptionally hard, so I did a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of farming, you can tell. Uh, I also tried to do a couple rolls. They didn't go anywhere, so yeah, but that's fine. <clears throat> Under the chill air, Virgilius introduces us to our upcoming destination. Where could the next golden bow be? The bus wasn't all that lively. I could hear Radia's occasional quips or Heathcliff starting pointless quarrels with someone, probably Don or Sinclair, and Ryoshu demanding a source of heat to light her cigarette, having run out of lighter fluid. Amidst the gripes and disorder, Gregor was pretty much the only sinner I could rely on to willingly turn the mood around. But now, he was one of the quietest. Yeah, he's probably still a little bit upset. He was just staring out through the window, seemingly lost in deep thought. One thing was for sure. If anyone were to blame for the if anyone were to blame for the trashing of the mood on the bus, it'd be Virgilius. Virgilius. The road to the golden bow was an awfully arduous one. Putting us on the brink of death, and some past that, several times. Not to mention the occasions when we almost ended up, well, shall we call it unemployed. Yet Virgilius refused to see it from our perspective. Given the circumstances, it's only natural for our sinners to be palpably disgruntled. Tired of the, tired of the silent treatment, Ishmael spoke up. <laughs> Couldn't you tell me where our next destination is now, at least? Ah, Oh, sorry about that. I was wondering whether briefing the mission to you miscreants would be worth the effort. You know what, I'm gonna deepen his voice a little bit. <clears throat> We're gonna keep potion, Sela, but I'm gonna deepen it a little bit. <laughs> You're hurting me with your cold shoulder. Don't you know that kids falling behind need more love? And let me plead you not to embarrass me this time. Well, no, that sounds that sounds kind of too samey to some other characters. <laughs> I mean, uh, I could give him a totally unique voice. Mm, I don't know, but the potion seller thing's kind of growing on me, you know what I mean? Oh, hop, tijoru, daddy, go. So, pungan and kyo saro poi go ship jin ananika. Alright, let's try this. <clears throat> and if this doesn't sound good, at least to me, then uh, we'll go back to potion seller. Oh, apparently I'm getting a free 14 day trial with malware by its nice. Thank you for that pop up. <laughs> Ahem. I sure don't want to look like a teacher taking a bunch of grade schoolers out for a picnic. What do we think about that? Eh, we'll, we'll do one more line with it. We'll see. I have high hopes for you in particular, Rodion. You might just make a good guide for this tour. Mm, okay. 
All right, I, I think we're on to something, maybe. Even though I enjoy this voice, this voice might have something a bit more to it. Okay, yeah. Huh? I know I'm a big deal, but I don't think I can be a guide for a place I don't know. No worries. We're heading to a location you should be more than familiar with. A nest of Hinduism, where you can drown in money or be drained of everything you have. J Sada. J Corpse. Great, even Radia's gone quiet now. There you go, Heathcliff. That's the spirit. <laughs> if we're gonna. And now, if we're going to die, we may as well die rich. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's how you look at it. Well, I suppose it wouldn't be so bad to win big while we're at it. Yeah, uh, alright. Oi, someone wake me up when we're there. Coincidentally, the bus will be unable to take you right to the branch building this time, dear passenger. Caron, Chongcha. Caron, park it. Oh, is this how you're punishing us? By making us walk? Caron? Uh. <laughs> oh, no! No! What's park? It means stop. Uh, is that actually wait a minute? Is that a low key stop to him? <laughs> nah, a low key diss to him, not stop. That that's what. Nah. Stops are red. Red tastes bad to Caron. Grumbling, Caron hit the brakes without warning, sending most of the sinners flying face first into the seats ahead and flinging others off of theirs. I was, of course, powerless, powerless against the inertia. A cacophony of complaints and shouts erupted. Although, I didn't get to hear the sinners' ramblings in clear detail. I am willing to bet a good half of them were profanities, so maybe I'm better off not knowing. Good to see you all full of energy. Now out. I like your outlook, but no, I don't think that's what he's doing. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is a punishment because we failed. Hmm, the destination still seemed rather far. Ah, will you call a taxi for us? As Miss Faust will explain in detail, this mission is going to be quite different from our last Dante. This is because the location of the Golden Bow is in the underground of a casino. Do you mean to tell us that it's among the brightly lit buildings standing at the center of that street? 그래. 저것들 중 하나다. That's right. It's one of those. 지난번 잠입했던 로보토니 지구는 오랫동안 방치된 곳이었죠. The lobotomy branch facility we infiltrated last time was one that had been neglected for quite a while. 그럼 그게 특수한 경우였다는 뜻인가요? So, so you mean that that was the exception? 이렇게 보면 머리를 굴릴 줄 아는 직원이 없는 것도 아닌데 예전 작전은 왜 그렇게 무참하게 망쳤을까? Also, sorry if you hear my fan. I know it's a little loud. I tried to turn it down, but it just doesn't quite want to listen to me, so... 
hopefully I'm able to drown it out at least a little bit. Although I do fully recognize that it's there. But not a lot I can do about it, unfortunately. Unless I just want to turn off all cooling to my computer, which I do not. See, it's times like this that remind me our team doesn't necessarily lack critical thinkers. It really does make me wonder how you managed to blunder your previous mission even more. <laughs> the golden bow is bow is a potent energy source, holding the essence of many technological marvels. <laughs> Such founts of energy will attract flows of wealth and people, and in no time, a whole civilization is built on top of it. Therefore, it's likely that future destinations will have been occupied by other factions and their structures. Which, in turn, indicates that we should be prepared to visit a wide variety of venues in addition to this casino. It also means that your first mission was a relatively easy one. Yet you somehow snatched defeat from the wide open maws of success. Does he usually hold grudges that long? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Don't ask me. We haven't known him much longer than you have. What do you say again? Something like, Welcome to Limbus Company. I'm your guide, Regilius. And all that. <laughs> Pretty good impression, wasn't it? You got his authoritative tone down to a T, I'll give you that. I had to hold myself back from asking if I could resign right after joining. I get the feeling the rest of you thought the same. <laughs> Nonsense! Twas a good day to go down in history, beckoned by the Red Gaze himself. Truly, there is no greater honor than a color addressing your- Oh, Huh, I guess he does have a fan after all. <laughs> True that. With their spirits lifted, Rodya and Gregor began to chuckle. That's more talking than necessary. I really do not wish for there to be an impetus impetus behind a third role rule for this bus ride wow that was a very difficult word for me I'd, i'm not sure why but oh well come on give the employees some room to badmouth their boss you're being totally petty <laughs> Next time, do it out of earshot. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm more fragile than I look, you see. For Achilles, was that a joke? Are you joking with us? Perhaps warming up to our presence? Hmm. <laughs> right. Time to get up and at it. I sure hope you come back with a golden bow in your hands this time. And if we bugger it twice? 
카론이 갑자기 개폐 버튼을 잊어버려서 문이 안 열리게 된다던가. Who knows? Caron might suddenly forget what button to press to open the door for you. Button, 빨간색, 맛없는 색이야. <coughs> button, red, yucky color. 네가 순 미친놈. You're one daft bloke. 네, 뭐. Blab, blab. 네, 뭐. Come on, there. And that means. 내리자 모자리들 이런 뜻이다. Shorthand for useless idiotic travelers going abscond now. Heathcliff glared at Ryoshu, insults welling up in his throat, only to then expel a loud sigh. He resigned uncharacteristically, as if he came to the realization that killing her wouldn't solve anything. Hey, that's a free 40 points right there. Holy crap, are there 20 missions in this? Ooh, okay, wow, 16 energy, we're going up. Foss explains what to do for this mission. As our first step, we should pay a visit to a certain pawn shop. Okay. Let's see, who do we want to bring? Best character, Foss. Um, allow me to give a rundown of the plan. Our primary objective is to infiltrate the casino unsuspected. It will be critical for the successful recovery of the Golden Bow. According to the information we've acquired, the casino has three entrances. One for ordinary visitors. One reserved for VIPs, and lastly, the back door used by employees. We'll split into three groups of four sinners to cover each entrance. Four of us will disguise as... Uh... Croupiers. Croup yes, croupiers, I think. I don't know. Four will pose as guests, and four will play the role of VIPs. Working in smaller groups will certainly draw less attention. It is wiser to divide rather than unite. Open the envelopes I gave out to confirm the role you've been assigned. Also, the higher-ups express concern over our performance. They stress that the company's future plans hinge on whether we can retrieve the Golden Bow through this operation. Therefore, we will collaborate on a joint operation. Joint operation? Our partner is a special forces unit consisting of professionals and veterans. I believe that they are now monikered the LCC, short for Limbus Company Clearance Department. Rest assured that they are our betters, at least in espionage operations. I thought 12 people was already a crowd. Guess someone finally realized that more isn't always merrier. Wowzer! <laughs> I haven't met staff from other teams before. Just where could they be? Hong Lu looked around, expecting Foss to bring them forward for introductions any second. Needless to say, no one showed up like he expected. We'll be heading to the pawn shop. 
Is pawning still a thing these days? This is the name of the city of the city of the city. We're in the so-called pawnbrokers avenue. Most businesses double as pawn shops here. That place is our rendezvous. Let's head inside. But first, we must destroy. Uh, you are weak to slash. All right. Well, dominating. Blue. Yellow. Yellow. Second orange. Death. Yes, I can already feel our victory being assured simply by us being in tune with one another. We killed most of them. Wow, look at that. Oh. That's three poise right there. Also, just so I'm clear, boost crit chance by 3% for the next one hit. Oh, yeah, that is what it does. <laughs> All right, yellow, blue, blue. No, green, green, blue, blue. And purple? This does more damage. Ow. Did you think you were rid of me? Ow. Oh. Ah. Just got hit by a bat twice. Two damage, all right. You got it, Sinclair. Get him. Get him. 21 damage. That's my boy. That's my boy right there. Um, let's see. Uh, good. Yes. Okay. Could go double blue. Actually, double blue or triple yellow? I think triple yellow actually will actually be more damage, so let's do that. What are you gonna do, tough guy? Huh? You think you're gonna get through me? 34 damage. Yeah, it seems like more damage. 25? Holy guacamole, Batman. Ain't there too many visitors at once? This shop's cramped as he is. Y'all prefer your look at the growl from Trump's or my song? As we entered the shop, we were met with the gruff greeting of an old pawnbroker. What's that bladder on about? Am I the only one here who read up on Nest J? Virgilius gave us a pamphlet to peruse before we left. <laughs> well, I think I remember glancing at the cover. Here, you'll get loaned different amounts depending on your fortune for the day. If you draw a great boon, you get extra cash. While misfortune means far less than what the pawn is worth. Ah. Ah, that reminds me. Our family had hired dedicated fortune tellers. <coughs> well, you know what? At least it's a good outlook, even if it's fake. They drew a greater boon for me in the divination be they performed before I left. That must have been a sign that I would join all of you wonderful people on our journey. Wow. Wow, really? So indulging in lofty leisure on your grand estate was your fated life. Maybe I should pray that I'm born that rich if there's a next time. I'm good. <laughs> it's well off folks like him who tend to play dirty. Mm, you might be right. I didn't like to get along with my younger sibling in childhood. Always trying to cheat and grouch if things didn't go as desired. 
To be fair, we met your uh, brother, so, uh, you yeah, know. No, that's not what I was getting at at all. So you want to get your fortune or not? Forget about that. Do you people have anything to pawn? I'm not seeing any wealth on you. The pawnbroker glanced over each sinner with a dubious look until his eyes landed on me. Oh, this Oh, that clock head might be worth a good sum. <coughs> How much do you think they sell for, old pal? Raja, I'm not for sale! As you were likely contacted in advance, we are from Limbus Company and... Unfortunately, neither the sinners nor the pawnbrokers were paying any attention to Foss' words. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did bring this handkerchief with me from when I left home. Oh, a dragon and why is his voice changing? That's a dragon embroidered on silk. That's a meticulous needlework, which might net let's see, seven million on? A crummy piece of cloth is worth that much? Have you rotted your eyes out, old geezer? Huh? You don't recognize the value of this quality? Uh, now I see. You're wearing a shabby ring like it's true treasure. I'm losing his voice every time I do it. What did you just say? Yeah, that. <laughs> the thing he said? Yeah, that. Jeez, cut it out. Dante, please shut them up. You have us worried, Faust. Amidst the chaos, the most gentle voice landed on my ears. We were meant to meet each other at four. The 15 minutes has already passed. Surely you couldn't have forgotten how to read a clock, right? Certainly not. There was little I could do to alter the driver of the bus. So you're taking a clock person with you to help with the time. I suppose they didn't come with an alarm. The gentle voice was soon followed by one that didn't even attempt to hide their disdain. Come on. That's a little harsh. Let's try to leave better first impressions. I know my voice won't be heard by anyone other than the sinners, but I still can't help but get upset at rude remarks. See, but it also means you can say whatever you want and they won't know. <laughs> you know what I mean? And that is true freedom. Saying something directly to someone's face and they have no idea, which I've had done to me at my store because they assumed I did not understand what they were saying in their language. But, look, this face, that's the face I had to keep. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, so it was you. You guys are the team that bought the golden bow retrieval last time. Folks had high expectations for your team, with what some of the smartest people in the city on it. No wonder Miss Faust wasn't looking very pleased. 
My face has remained constant. Yeah, <laughs> Uh, well, <laughs> you know, you're, you're, pl you're plenty smart. You, yeah, yeah, you're, 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 yeah. Hey, what are you standing ground for? Go on now. This fella here is also the brainy sort. Don't brush him off. Heathcliff gave Ye oh Yisong. I thought he meant himself. He gave Yisong a sideways glance, but what he got in, <laughs> in response was lukewarm. <laughs> I shall not, as that would be a hollow vaunt. But you were a lot more talkative down in that basement. Who are you and what did you do with Yisong? <laughs> I am and have always been whom I match in the mirror. Yeah. <sighs> y you! Ah! Forget it. Our first mission was devised with failure in mind. We needed an opportunity to see what potential our sinners had. Wait, it was? A plan whose purpose is to fail? That could hardly qualify as a proposal. By the way, where is Virgilius? I agreed to assist with the operation mainly for a chance to get to see him. Okay, so you're both gonna betray us and then you're gonna hit us with something like, Haha, we are betraying you because you are unworthy to work alongside him. Therefore, with you dead, he will have no choice but to bring us alongside him. I can see it coming a mile away. He must have been embarrassed. Imagine accompanying people like these. No, it's because he's punishing us. Is that why he dropped us so far away from the place? Because he was ashamed of us? <sighs> Doesn't anyone have a thing to say about us being belittled? And won't all the boasting and bluffing not do much if we don't introduce ourselves first? These two will be our cooperators for the mission. They're from the Limbus Company Clearance Department, also known as the LCC. The before team of clearance, please. Ah, oh, I'm sad. And this here is Evie, Effie, I don't know. What, are we supposed to clap, or...? Uh, wonderful, it's a pleasure. Hong Lu was the only person on the team welcoming them with total sincerity. He almost even gave a standing ovation. A good half of the rest stared at the two with cold eyes, and the others wary until introductions were finished. Level up! Incafallon has been refilled! Nice! That's why I did a little bit of farming. I knew we were going to get it refilled. 49 XP a pop? Dude, that's almost as much as a dungeon we just did. Now I realize most of them are 33, but still. Jeez. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. A flawless plan. Our team will join hands with a duo from the clearance department. The sinners cast a skeptical glance at their competence and... Com... Comperment. Oh, it doesn't cost any energy. All right, so we got another... How many levels are in this one? Hello, you might have noticed a super hard cut. That's because... <laughs> the last part to this part has been like two weeks. But that's okay. Uh, I did a little bit of farming off screen because I was warned that the upcoming battles are going to be extremely hard. So... I figured, hey, why not? 
Um, so, here's what we got. Uh, sinners. So, everybody is now 15, relatively close to 16. Um, I didn't want to go too completely overkill, and even though I was not able to play because of internet problems, I still made sure to try and log in to get as much value as possible. So, as you can see, we have 67, um... Enkephalon modules, so when it comes time to get to the mirror dungeons and stuff, we're gonna have energy. We're gonna be good to go. So, uh, I also learned a couple things in the meantime. For example, I learned that apparently I could have used Ego the entire time. Thank you both comments and the Discord for telling me that. Um, I was under the impression that I had to finish this dungeon in order to unlock them or get to a certain spot in the game. No, you literally can just use them whenever, so long as you have the right affinity. So that's cool, that's great. So that dungeon didn't have to be nearly as hard as it was. I also learned how to check the stats of people. You left click and hold, <laughs> and it's legit that easy. That's all you do, and then you can see their passives, you can see their skills, you can see what type of defense they have, whether they have a, uh, a riposte, an evade, or a guard. So, that's nice. I wish I would have known that a little sooner. And, yeah, overall, that should be everything. Here's a clip of me learning how to use Ego. Also, I totally forgot to mention it. Uh, we got a ton of free stuff given to us. <laughs> in between my little vacation and recording here again. So, I just wanted to show that real quick. And one of the cool things that we actually got is a free 10 summon. And in that 10 summon, you get a guaranteed three star and mine was none other than G Corp Gregor himself. Bannerman is now mine. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna try and pull off Don's um, ego, and I wish to be coached, please. Okay. All right, Shadow Man. It's not that hard. Mm -hmm. Trust. Yeah, it's, it's not. What's your team so far? Okay, that's. Oh yeah, you, fuck it. You can fucking get it. Yeah. Yeah, you can I, get it. You just haven't been getting it. Yeah, I just haven't done it. Here, let's yeah, you just haven't oh. been doing it. Yeah. Wow. Has so uh, Shadow's been doing a little bit of stupid and haven't done a single ego yep. i can put that into my youtube tags no ego <laughs> all right so basically shadow shadow yes. all right let me coach you through this okay uh top row just top row just top row. just go straight top row okay like that yep that's it <laughs> look guys they're fighting it's super interactive <laughs> yeah ab no guys, fights feel so much better they i do. will say this they're really they fun yeah. Yeah. yeah is, All right. Running, um. Now just keep going. J j okay. Up again. Just just straight up again. Yeah. Up. Uppies. 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 Up. up. <laughs> Give me uppies. I'm gonna kill you anyway. Why? <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. But no. Um, genuinely. Uh, all right. And now um, go over to uh, Don. Yeah. And hold down. Oh. And then press the ego. And now you can do the ego. I, I could have done this the whole time. Yeah, you yes, could have done so this the whole time. You can even do Faust's. Well, not anymore. You uh, use the stuff for it. You use the ego. Just... Yeah. Yeah. Now obliterate someone. You can see the cute animation. Obviously, that was taken from the Discord, and I made sure everyone was okay with it. And they've told me multiple times that, uh, it's okay to be in a video, so I figured, hey, we may as well give him one time in the spotlight, eh? I know you're watching. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, so. Nope, wrong one. Um, there's been a couple updates in the meantime, and I'm gonna warn you now, my voices are not going to be perfect since it has been a little bit of time in between last episode. No, not last time I recorded, and this time, not last episode, 
because uh, this is still technically the exact same episode. So we're going to get a little bit further. I want to do just a few more levels, and then we're going to see how it goes. Now, something I do want to bring up. Let's go to drive and window. Um, apparently, there's a lot of levels in freaking chapter two. So we're going to do as many as we can. I know this episode's already getting a bit long. So I want to prevent this series being a three hour episode only kind of deal. So we're going to do a couple more. I'm going to check the time. If we got good time, then I'll keep going. If not, we're going to end it quote, quote, early. So without further ado, here we go. Oh, this doesn't even take uh, energy. That's nice. Like I said, the voices are going to be off. You're going to have to pardon me for that. Now, for this mission, we'll basically spoon-feed you everything. All you have to do is open wide and chew up your simple tasks. Check the documents in this envelope and do exactly, precisely as the papers say. I do actually want to turn them up a little bit, if I'm able. Okay, I messed with the settings a little bit, so if it's too loud, don't worry, I'll turn it down <laughs> soon. The way Saw dragged out that vowel needled me a bit, but I decided not to argue. Saw the. Even if I did, the ticking of a clock would be all she'd hear. It's not a lot of joining together at all in, in this joint operation, is there? You're just telling us to follow from behind. This is insulting. Are they taking us for lovers or what? Look, manager, we've got to put our foot down and... And... Do as they say, I guess? Huh? The documents they gave us, they're flawless. Look at this. It has routes drawn out and everything. It's been ages since I saw a plan this clear and meticulous. Hmm. Surely. This is certainly indicative of their knowledge in writing up proper plans of operation. Well, she had to kiss up somehow. <laughs> ah, that isn't to say it holds a candle to the level of forethought you display, manager. Convinced by Ishmael's commendation, I opened the envelope and carefully read the rundown of the operation. The goal could be summarized as the following. Reach the top floor of the casino. <laughs> That's it. The main reason behind organizing this plan was the first place prize for the gamble for the table game it's basically gambling to be held today according to the papers winning the competition held on the top floor of the casino is the only way to gain access to the area with the golden bow four syndicates that jointly bid on the casino will be playing in this game of chance of the four we will be using the name of the infamous Tin Tang Gang? A name doesn't necessarily reflect the nature of, the, of an organization. That's a shallow prejudice. It is unideal for one to choose to see things through the tinted lens that is bias. Right. Back to the plan. We'll disguise as the boss of the Tin Tang Gang and win that game of chance. Afterwards, we have to go to the underground floor where the Golden Bow lies. 
Leading up to that game, we'll use the items and clothing we can find in pawn shops to disguise as our given roles, enter the casino, and wait for the team on the top floor to win the game. That's about it for the outline of this plan, I think. <sighs> hey, wait a second. Won't this entire thing fall apart if our player doesn't win? <laughs> We've prepared fake identification as well. It's just in case the casino security runs random inspections on visitors. <laughs> 다 좋은데 꼭대기층의 갬블에서는 어떻게 이길 작전이야? Good idea, Gregor. All right, that's all fine and dandy, but how do you plan to win once you're at the top floor? 우리 복장을 보면 감이 잡히지 않아? What do you think our outfits are for? 카지노 딜러로 자연스럽게 섞이기 위해 몇 개월을 연습했지. We practiced for months to pass off as bona fide. Uh, cruel bears. I'm just going to imagine that it's said very fancily like that. 알아서 좋은 패를 넘겨줄 거야. 눈만 멀쩡히 달려 있으면 이기는 건 걱정할 필요도 없지. We'll give you good luck. The game is in your bag. All you need is a pair of functioning eyes. Ify mumbled the last part to himself again while casting a sidelong scowl at our group. He's making it painfully obvious he has no faith in us. And how are we going to take the place of the Tin Tang Gang's boss? We'll put sedatives in the food served at the casino. We've already finished negotiating the details with the head chef. Sedatives. Sada and Ify. Yeah, that's how they're said. Winked at each other. It was a gesture demonstrating that the two were ideal partners, able to tell each other's thoughts just from exchanging glances. They're setting us up to fail. They're setting us up to fail. They want us to die so that they can go and get the golden bow. Come on. Tale as old as time. You want us to fail. <laughs> 진열 때 여기서부터 저기까지 물건들 좀 보고 있을게요. Hey, dear pawnbroker, we'll be taking a good look at the goods on showcase from here to there. 네, 하, 하, 아이고, 예, 그러면요, 천천히 둘러보세요. Yeah? Oh, no, yeah, sure, of course. Please take your time, ma'am. The pawnbroker's attitude took a sharp turn from disdainful. Ten... To what? To kowtowing? Co kowtowing? I have never seen that word in my life. 그럼 다들 진열장에서 알맞은 물건을 가져가죠. That isn't even like <clears throat> me just not knowing how to pronounce a word. I have never seen that word in my life. <laughs> uh, I I would imagine it's like from uh, to oh, you know, like. I'd imagine it's that, but I don't know. Now then, let's take what we need from the display. Oh my, this is a Gupcha designer brooch, isn't it? Yeah, you got a lot of us in a bunny case. It's a joy, turn down for it. Tedder boy, Joe. You'll give a catch as I get under so I'm a pull of a yeah! <laughs> what a discerning eye! What discerning eyes you have there, sir! These built of our mainstay of our shop's catalog! Only ten of them. <laughs> what is happening to his voice? I'm so sorry. <clears throat> I am really struggling with the voices, I apologize. Only ten of those were ever made! So it's positively. its worth is positively un. Toyjip Kanajiga, Sanchikal Temada Kigudanin and Bokju Changshigi or soil. My dog used to have one of these on its collar whenever we took it out for walkies. It's so nice to see something that brings back pleasant memories. I'm 
이걸 샀던 녀석은 아마 패션 센스가 남달랐을 것 같아. I'm down. I'm down for these cowhide gloves. Whoever had them must have been a fashionista. 봉투에 적혀 있는 대로 가져가세요. 각자 맡은 역할이 있답니다. Please take items that suit what's written in the envelopes. <laughs> you have roles to play. 이부쇼, 내 봉투에는 청소부라고 써져 있는데 뭔가 차고가 있는 것 같소만. No, <laughs> no, Don has to be the sweeper. No. Pardon, but the envelope I have received says janitor. This must be an error of some kind. 좋아, 다 좋은데 돈은 어떻게 지불할 작정이야? Okay, it's good and all, but do you have the money to pay for all this? 격 떨어지게 예산 걱정을 왜 하는 거야? 이 블랙 카드로는 못 끊는 게 없어. Worrying about spendings. Who do you think we are? Some low-rank hirelings? There's nothing I can't afford using this black card. 단테, 어떻게 된 거야? 투뿔 고기는 예산 딸려서 못 먹는다며. Dante, what's this about? You told me we can't have prime beef because we don't have the budget. 수준 이상의 성과를 보이는 부사에겐 회사에서 한도 없는 카드를 준다는 소문이 사실이었군요. So the rumors were true that teams with notable performance are given a company card with no spending limit. While everyone was shocked by the proven existence of the fabled black card, a loud voice came from outside. Oi, Harbe! 오늘까지 자리 세내야 한다는 거 나만 아는 사실이었어? Oi, Dota! Didn't I say your payment was due today? Someone who clearly belongs to a vicious syndicate entered the pawn shop. How much you want to bet? Dude on the right is from, uh, <laughs> is from the very thing that we're gonna I impersonate. P please, give me one more chance. I swear I'll have the money ready. Someone? Harbe, do you want to say that? You said the same thing as Actually, you know what? I have a better idea for his voice. One more. Got you doing basic math. You said the same thing last time. Boss will not be wasting precious time reteaching you kindergarten, yeah? <laughs> oh, I like that way more. I'm just a frail old man standing on daughtery feet. He's got a gun or something. <laughs> There's really nothing you'll get out of shaking me down. Pleading with an overtly loud voice, the pawnbroker looked at us. Eh? You talk her back now. Yeah, go on then. Get mad. I don't feel so guilty that way. In a way, he looked like he was covertly begging us to help him, based on his expression. Ah, <sighs> the sinners' attention was naturally drawn to the ongoing bro. Hugi Mulba! Kugyong Nanya! What are you looking at? You think I'm playing? Wow, Chinta Chanyong Jogin Tesaraso, Tekwa Gushi to Anna Soil. Gee, that was so stereotypical, I didn't even get an urge to reply. Can't people be more creative about throwing taunts? Uh, shouldn't we help out, maybe? <laughs> Unlike Ishmael, who scoffed at the goon, Sinclair anxiously glanced over. Sure we are. We have no choice. The back streets have their own rules and order. We aren't the ones who disturb that complex web of their society. Outsiders like us will only cause a bigger scene if we try to step in. 
pleased by the sinners choosing to stay away, the goon continued with the extortion. <laughs> If you ain't got money, why don't you pay your dues in that instead? But we keep telling you. Anything but that, please. Is it really okay to leave them be? Young Pugi Kurashinan, Sega Nasaka, Kalizani. Shall I settle the dispute for them so it does not bother you, manager? What does that dumpster mean by that, anyway? A currency more valuable than money exists in this district. It's well known that J Corp Singularity is a powerful security technology capable of locking anything. What is less known, however, is the extensive cultural and historical background of the back streets of Nest J that led to the Singularity's creation. <laughs> History? Are you seriously about to lecture us here and now? Oh man, I sound even worse than I did before, but you know what? <laughs> That's fine. This is perfectly fine. You know what? <laughs> now he's got the, uh, the piece of wheat really sticking from his mouth. <laughs> I was never told any mandatory education when I joined this company. In spite of the opposition, Faust went on with her explanation because she's got to be smarter than absolutely everyone in the room. Here, a technology exists to extract wish power from people. Though it's not widely known outside this district, since it didn't quite have the generality to be recognized as a singularity. In essence, it's processing luck into a commodity that can be traded, like a form of money. It brought forth the need for a way to stop others from forcibly extracting this wish power, leading to the creation of a security technology that ultimately developed into the singularity we know today. Yeah, Faust. Gee we fast. Gee we. Hmm. Must be tiring having to teach these dunces in ways that they can get it. <laughs> it's fine. This was within my anticipated scenario, as well as my untimely death, I hope. <laughs> I don't like the way you say that. 자, 자. 그럼 우린 진열대에 있는 적당한 물건들을 각자 집은 다음에 여길 벗어나자고요. Come on now. Gather the items to help with your disguises so we can leave. Sorta flapped the document full of scheduled plans to emphasize that we'd be busy. 우린 일개 회사원이지. 정의를 위해 나서는 히어로가 아니잖아요. We're salaried workers, not heroes fighting for justice. Wait, not that word. A bad feeling rushing through my head prompted me to count the sinners I could see. Uh-oh. That does not align with a certain someone's <laughs> beliefs. And it's one that would severely provoke her principles. <gasps> 
Ishmael seems to have noticed what I meant and hurriedly looked around. <laughs> oh boy. Thou darest try to pilfer the valuables of others? This behavior can only be seen as wholehearted villainy! Oh no, Don kicks out! But it was a moment too late. Don. Don had already sprinted forward and was swinging her lance at the Ting Tanger who gripped the pawnbroker by the collar. Whack! Caught completely unaware, the goon was hit right on the head with the bullet inside of her lance. Knocked out on the floor in a frisky swing, the fainted goon became the center of attention for all of us inside the pawn shop for a solid minute. Oh. Oh. 참고로 수감자들을 통제하는 역할은 제게 주어진 업무에 포함되지 않았어요. <coughs> 이쪽 분의 역할이죠. Oh no, now that the situation has gone bad, I better push all attention elsewhere. Now it's no longer my fault. I no longer wish to be the center of attention. I am, in fact, the worst character. <laughs> I know for a fact there's gonna be some people in the comments who are like, You don't like Faust? Even though you like Angela? Well, to be fair, I didn't like Angela at first either, but she grew on me, so maybe Faust will too. So give me my time to to hate her, because maybe I'll love her later. <laughs> ah, for your information, keeping the sinners in check is not part of my job description. That would be the job of this person here. Also, I definitely know that uh, a few of you are upset at my lack of reading skills, so just to very quickly go over that, I'm sorry. It's kind of hard to do voices and commentate and read while also trying, no, and play the game, while also trying to remember passives and stuff. I'm sorry, I do my best, but clearly my best isn't good enough. <laughs> Don't give me that look. There's nothing in my abilities to keep her under control. I couldn't stop myself from defending my position, even when I was aware that my voice wouldn't reach anyone besides the sinners. Oh well. It's not like my defense would have made them look any less baffled towards me if they could hear it. <laughs> the pawnbroker was the only one chuffed by this turn of events. Good work, man. Serves that hooligan right. But I'll say you could have whooped him a tad harder, maybe. Pergiliusga! Virgilius advised me that while I am free to deliver justice on the villains, I must do so without unduly involving irrelevance in our mission. Thus, I showed moderation. Her proud expression never looks so provoking. Uh-huh. She remembered his words and still leapt forward. <laughs> Twas a necessary action to stay true to my creed. Please understand my virtuous violence. Not to kill the mood, but that ruffian isn't actually dead, right? Youngam. I thought you wanted her to get straight to Wallops, old sport. I, I did, I did. But things would get fairly complicated if the Euro Divie showed up, you know. Euro Divi? Kenega, where you are? Ani, Kuboda, Kenego, where are you? The, I'm gonna try and say it like she just did. The Euro... Euro the Euro Divi? Mm. What are they doing here? Mm. No, forget that. Why are you worrying about them? Not up to date with the news, are you, ma'am? They've been causing trouble here for months now. 
그들도 악당인가? <웃음> oh no, don't say it. Are they villains as well? 아유, 저희한테는 악당이죠. 나 이거 뭐라 그랬더라? 돈을 공치고 있는 장사치들을 쫓아서 힘든 사람에게 나눠야 한댔나? 뭐의 분배라 하던데? Oh, they're villains to us humble merchants for sure. There, they were going on about what was it? Roughing up greedy peddlers, keeping money to themselves and giving it to those who need it, distributing something they said. The redistribution of wealth. Ah, 맞아요, 그거. 아유, 우리들이 무슨 돈이 있다고? 심지어 자기들이 와서 그러는 것도 아니에요. 매번 이 지역 깡패들을 시켜서 그러고 다니다니까요. Ah, that's it. Yes. Those scoundrels are robbing us poor saps of what little wealth we have, and they didn't even need to do the dirty work themselves. It's always the local brutes they send. Can you believe it? 하여간 지들이 옳은 일 한답시고 기세 등등하게 다녀서 힘들어요. 처음에는 뭘 찾으려고 하는 것 같았는데 이제는 돈이나 빼꿀. Anywho, life has been hard for us because of those self-righteous bunches. Looked like they were here to find something at first, but now all they do is squeeze money out of us. Ah, ah. 근데 말이야, 우리 피해하지 않을까? 콩콩이 파들이 들이닥칠지도 모르는데. Ah, I just realized. Shouldn't we take our leave now? More toughies from the Ting Tang gang might be coming this way. It seemed like Radia deliberately cut off the pawnbroker in a hurry, but I had little time to think about the implications. The gang member Don had the gang member Don had knocked out began to flinch as though to get back up soon. Ah, 골치 아프게 쓸데없이 일만 벌려서는. What a hassle! You're making the problem bigger than it had to be. 아이 봐, 머핀과 소보를 했나? 아 이거 너무 표정 구기지 말라고. 놀려 있는 게 전당포잖아. 얼마든지 대체를. Hey, muffin and sabo, wasn't it? Don't be so tart now. There are plenty of pawn shops around here, right? We can always find a different. 에피랑 소드예요. 사람 이름을 맛있게 만들어 주시지는 않았으면 좋겠어요. It's Efi and Sod. Please don't mistake our names for confections. 그리고 널려 있는 게 전당포라는 뜻은 다시 말해. And your statement that there are plenty of pawn shops in the vicinity. <laughs> Won't mean much. 이 소동을 눈치챈 모든 전당포가 곧 문을 닫을 거라는 소리랍니다. When said pawn shops notice the trouble happening here and close. Don. 바보들한테 일일이 설명하기도 이제 지친다. 얼른 나가자. I'm getting tired of lecturing these idiots on every little thing. We should just leave. Right as I tried to leave, someone wearing similar thuggish clothes to the one we just knocked out, with a face that looked just as rough, stormed into the shop. Hey, young gum. 우리 막내 보지 못했. 어여 꺼져. 아저씨 나왔네. 피시라. 이게 다 무슨 일이냐? Wait, Slimmy. What's going on there? We did our best to pretend to be innocent customers who just happened to be in the pawn shop at the wrong time. However, in an unfortunate concurrence of events, the goon came back to senses. Who did this? Tell me now! That bean is gonna regret the day they grew stems! Joggy. Over there. My God. Shikit. Tegari. The red. Time plus. What? Why is it my fault? The direction that finger was pointing was simply too unambiguous for me to pretend otherwise. Plus, there's no point in denying that I was meant by red time plus, as I'm sure there would be literally no one else matching that description in this entire district. 노파심에 덧붙이지만 저는 전혀 모르는 일입니다. 이제 막 얼음찜질을 해드리려고 수건을 가지고 가려던 참이었었죠. Yes, so you don't get the wrong idea. I have nothing to do with these people or what happened here. I 
I was just about to bring a towel to cool this poor fellow's head. That smarmy gaffer. He did on it, man. Chutteragon and Parame Hundelin and Kaltaman to Butaneo. I had no expectations for him in the first place, but that man has a really shaky read for his backbone. Although the pawnbroker switching sides in a heartbeat and the finger pointing clock slander over something I wasn't responsible for, too, hurt me a little. I was determined to stand firm. Yeah. Stop. Don't come on. Do you know, feel like you should be? <laughs> no, I, I should not do that voice. I was gonna swap his voice too, and then immediately rethought it. But I was gonna <laughs> jaw free. <laughs> Y'all be over there. Stop and freeze in your tracks. <laughs> oh, that's the worst possible voice. <laughs> Oh no! Now I feel like we should keep it! <laughs> Mostly because it was clear that we had to run right now. If I kept letting small things bother me, I would be reduced to a pulp sooner rather than later. <laughs> no need to run. Let's just kill them all and be done with it. What's next? You're going to wipe out the whole syndicate? <laughs> that doesn't sound too bad. The forces of evil must be uprooted with haste in order to raise the banner of justice high. Uh, so... Is there seriously no one on your team who's in their right mind? Ishmael looked insulted by this remark and seemed to be thinking of a counter-argument. But the Ting Tang goons arming themselves were a more pressing matter. Let's just... Let's get out of here first! Nice. Wow, that was a long one. <laughs> Jeez. Clear within 10 turns. The plan that seemed so perfect took little time to go awry. Don's outburst runs us afoul with the Tin Tang Gang. Parago? Na? <sighs> As Sada predicted, all the pawnbrokers were busy closing their street entrances to avoid trouble. Sekidra! I you stop right where you're standing. <laughs> there you go. You know what? That's better. You think you can get away? With messing with our family, tiny five. Toron chip dandrun. Wekok sorul kajogira go burjo. Opten you dega mulchiotanea hanika. What's with the British syndicates and their pretend families? Is that the only thing they can think of to bond with each other? Look at the bump he made on our precious youngin's head! <laughs> Good gracious, this was not part of the plan. Yifi clutches his forehead as if it were aching. I thought about goading him to keep some headache pills at hand if this was enough to cause him pain, but I refrained. My lack of a head would have made the message far less impactful anyway. You too. You thought we were worthless scum until now, didn't you? I know you've been seeing our group as sewage full of waste. I don't think anyone spoke of us that harshly, Otis. Have you not wondered why we have been charged with the momentous mission of claiming golden bows despite that? 
뭔데요? Why is that? Even if he seemed to be taken aback by Otis's imposing attitude. 비록 다른 자들이 오수 속에 절여진 폐기물이라는 건 동감한다만. <웃음> wow, gee, thanks. Oh, watch. She's gonna add on, except for the manager. <웃음> Although I won't disagree that the others are rubbishes, drenched in foul water. 글쎄, 그렇게 생각하는 건 당신뿐이라니까. No, seriously, you're the only one who says that. 오티스 씨는 항상 저희를 그런 시선으로 바라보셨던 거군요. <웃음> oh, Sinclair. <웃음> Poor baby. <웃음> uh, oh. That's what Miss Otis had been thinking all this time. 나는 무전무패의 역사를 가지고 있고 관리자님은 불사에 가까운 치유를 할수 있는 소생 능력을 지니고 있으시지. I have remained undefeated, and our manager is capable of resuscitating us, making us practically incapable of death. 사실 둘만 있어도 충분해. 베르길리우스 그 작자는 나와는 생각이 다른 모양이지만. In fact, just the two of us should be sufficient. Though that weasel Virgilia seems to disagree. 어쨌든 아무리 무수한 전투를 치러도 폐기물들은 폐기되지 않는다. 폐기물인 채로 그대로 부활할 뿐이다. Wow. The point is, these detrites won't be scrapped even after countless battles. They will come back as the exact same piles of trash they were even before death. <웃음> 멋지다는 듯이 말하긴 했지만. 결국 저희를 쓰레기 취급하는 것뿐이었네요. That was a very inspiring way of reaffirming that we're living, breathing garbage to you. 뭐저리들 Morons. 적군들이 몰려오는 것. 준비되셨습니까, 관리자님? Enemies are approaching. Are you prepared, manager? Here we go. Okay, so I'm gonna try. And you, Samigo. Hmm. Yeah. So that's two dark blues, two oranges. Yeah, that should be good. Bunk. What's the matter? You losing a couple clashes? Oh. Big damage. All right. Let's see. Dark blue, orange, orange, dark blue. 출진이다. Alright, that works for me. So, see how we're glowing? That means if we hold left click, we can use an ego. <laughs> so, boom. There's our ego. Nope. Yep. Yeah, there's our ego. Then we go green, blue, green, blue, blue. All right. This should be good. This should be real good. Here we go. It's time for the ego. Twenty damage and a stagger. Yeah, that works for me. Ouch. Okay, we take a little bit of damage. Jeez. Okay, so that's a stagger. Unfortunate. You know what? It's Gregor's time to shine. So let's go red because it doesn't matter. Yellow. Blue, purple, purple. Yeah. Go on. Come down. Oh yeah. My pardon. Your name is Tosso. Oh, that works. <laughs> Wow, it turns out that the egos are actually pretty strong when you use them correctly. Who would have guessed? Uh, that being said, I guess we can use hers too. There you go. 
So it's a blue, so let's go orange, orange, green, green, blue, 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 green, green. They're dead. Uh, 14 damage, easy. Uh, 14 more damage. Oh, we lose that one, but we didn't take too much damage. Okay. Ooh, we all recovered sanity for that, actually. Hey, Look at that, we've got plenty of Inca Fallon now. <laughs> Alright, everyone is just about level 16, and we are level 14. So with that, I believe that is going to do it for this episode of the Limbus Company. In the next one, we are going to get a lot more progress a lot quicker, because I feel like we've gotten through all of the really big story stuff. We've got through the casino, uh, we got through Flawless Plan, and so we'll see if there's any giant uh, lore stuff in the coming missions. However, my goal is to get to the dungeon entrance. That's my goal. We're going to see what happens, but that's what we're shooting for. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully my farming was not too unwelcome especially since I did it off screen. Um, and let's see. In the next episode, we should hit a couple level 16s. Now that I know how to use Ego, I may as well just use it. Also, uh, I got this from the free battle pass, so I'm led to believe that this should be okay to use. Um, but let me know what you guys think. If Because in my mind, I as far as the series goes, I'm going completely free to play. So the reason I have Ebony Stem on is because you do not need to spend any money to get Ebony Stem. So, I feel like it should be usable, um, since it was on the free banner. Now, there are some more things on the free banner. We have Impending Day, so when we get Impending Day, we'll use that. And then... Ledger Domain... That will be another one, I believe, that we can use. Uh, you want to get beat hurtily? Should be another one. Uh, Roseate Desire should be okay. Um, the second Roseate Desire. Rhyme Shank. And then... Fourth Match Flame. So overall, I'm thinking since all of those are on the free section of the Battle Pass, Season Pass thingy, um, they should be free, no, well actually yeah, free to use, haha. -ha. So let me know how you guys feel about that. If you don't think I should use those, I won't. Um, but since they are free literally just for playing the game, um, I'm actually thinking that they should be fine. But I would be curious what you guys think. So, without further ado, thank you for listening to all my rants, and thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.